so I feel like something you have been working on has been making you feel a little bit of anxiety okay but I feel like you're being strong you're still going you're working through it and I feel like that's what's going on I don't know what exactly you've been working on but it's something that has been causing a bit of anxiety but you're still strong you're still going and you're doing a great job by the way also I feel like there was someone who you feel like maybe left you to go work on things with someone else okay and I feel like this person made it seem like they wanted to stay committed to you or they wanted something to work out and they started like t taking their time with you not making a decision kind of just almost like leading you on but just like taking their time not making a decision just yeah that's what I'm getting and it's like you feel like you had to heal from this and and you really had to actually put in work to heal from this so I feel like you could be really frustrated towards this person like if you were to see them or speak to them it wouldn't be like hey how are you like I don't feel like that at all also I feel like this person is matching your energy I feel like they're like becoming irritated with you because you're either ignoring them or you're not chasing them so I feel like there's an irritation on both ends so yeah definitely irritated that you're not reaching out you're not chasing whatever you know is going on with that but that's what I'm getting okay I feel like this ending happened quick like I feel like one day everything was like you know you were talking or I just feel like or how do I say this I just feel like it ended quick like it just was like done like in one day one day one second okay so I feel like yeah, I feel like you were working on things with this person and then it just ended and then you were like burdened and then really regretful like that you even like put time into this and it's like I feel like this person from your past like made you feel very confused. I feel like this person made you feel like you put too much of yourself or too much of your time into this and it almost makes you feel like regretful and you feel like damn in the future I got to do it different. I can't give too much of myself. I got to do it this way. I can't do it that way and I feel like it made this like made you real feel real confused like you had to like go about relationships in a different way because this person screwed you over so I feel like you're conflicted or you're you might be beating yourself up at the fact that you didn't make a decision sooner on this person I feel like you might have just waited and hoped that things will get better and they didn't and I feel like you wish you left sooner that you made a decision on this person sooner because they snuck behind your back where you see full lied and left you out in the cold so yeah you like felt juggled you felt guarded and you're starting to realize that you are so defensive towards this person and it's like you know you see i feel like you are seeing or you are thinking like if this person came in the right way and fixed it the right way there might be a chance to like balance this out but they would have to come in in the right way and that's what i'm getting also some of you guys this isn't for everyone so only take it if you if this is for you but some of you guys might be doing negative things for money not good things for money and it's coming up in the cards and this is something that is actually making you feel like heartbroken or anxious or not too good inside and you might not even be realizing it but it's definitely affecting your energy so realize that okay it's not worth the money okay other than that you are going to be getting a um, communication soon, an offer soon, and it's going to actually make you kind of giddy, really happy, because at one point you felt stuck and ignored by this person, and I feel like you haven't spoken to them in a really long time. So honestly, I do feel like you're going to be like a little bit giddy, a little bit happy, but that's not to say you're going to like let them in, but let's see what's going on. Okay. Yeah, you're going to be like, okay, this is my wish fulfillment. This is what I like wanted i wanted them to come in and apologize or i wanted them to come in and whatever you wanted whatever was your wish fulfillment is going to be happening with this person let's see let's see let's ask how is this person feeling towards you how is this person feeling towards you ten dollar readings for 15 minutes below email me okay so 
This person is feeling stuck over the fact that they lied to you and snuck behind your back. So they're feeling very stuck that they did this and went to a third party. So they're basically miserable and beating themselves up over the fact that they did that to you. Look, oh my God. So look, they're feeling stuck because they snuck behind your back and went to this third party and left you out in the cold. That's crazy because the cards are very like in your face. This is what happened and simple. Okay, so this person feels like they juggled you and basically they were trying to, they were like juggling you and someone else like thinking, okay, let's see like who I wanna choose. Like it's a freaking game show. And it's like, a set, like they thought that this was gonna be like a great thing like okay I'll choose what's whatever's best and guess what now they're feeling heartbroken and conflicted over their freaking choice also they're feeling very conflicted and confused over something regarding their sexual life I don't know what that's about I feel like people are starting to become very angry with this person because this person is having sex with people and then leaving them or not talking to them after that. And there are people who are becoming very angry and frustrated with this person. So I feel like this person is beginning to understand, okay, I gotta stop what I'm doing. I gotta stop what I'm doing. I gotta heal myself from this sexual toxic shit that I'm doing. It's not okay. And it's starting to affect them, okay? They wanna come in and offer you something, but they're feeling really anxious. I feel like they have feminines after them at this point. I feel like they have feminines after them and it's affecting their sleep. So, they want to stay committed to coming towards you. They actually see that see you as like their match, if not their soulmate. They're definitely thinking on your past. Very nostalgic. They they feel like they didn't make a decision, and because they didn't make a decision, things ended. And they're very burdened because they see you as their wish fulfillment. Okay. Yep. They want to manifest something with you. They took their time. They took their time working on this with you, and now they're realizing that they do have. A lot of emotions for you so they're starting to become defensive because they want to balance this out with you and they're holding on to you and they're holding on to what they didn't do and they feel like basically they ignored their happiness that's how they feel yeah they feel like they haven't spoken to you and they want to come in and give to you they feel like you're like their complete stability like this relationship would be complete stability and they and they they see as them communicating is gonna bring them happiness them seeing you is gonna bring them happiness and they're becoming frustrated or irritated because you're not chasing okay so they're becoming irritated that you're not chasing them or you don't want to see them you don't want to meet with them whatever it is and that this is what is going to cause them to come flying in and yeah also they are seeing something or like watching you somehow and this is making them want to offer you something because they feel like you're not looking at them and you're worried about yourself your stability whatever it is 